early 2009, I began traveling the country, uh, photographing closet service members in a way where you couldn't see their faces. My name is Jeff Shang, and the name of the exhibition is Don't Ask, Don't Tell. Service members actually emailed me, this was about two, three years ago, asking if I had ever considered working on a project on Don't Ask, Don't Tell. A lot of these service members wanted a way for them to make a statement on the issue without fully revealing themselves and hence losing their jobs. There's something beautiful about that. The segregation, the hate, the secrets. It's foreign. No, I'm sad. That service member fought in Afghanistan twice. And there's something so beautiful about the way he's alone and and you can't see his face entirely. There's a concealment that's just there enough to make you wonder who he really is. I think there's this very interesting thread of loneliness and isolation. When I was serving, uh, I felt like I was kind of like the only one. I was pretty young when I started at the academy. I, I was 17 years old. To be honest, I had no idea I was gay. I found myself making up lies and then making up more lies to cover the lies I had told before. Oftentimes when I asked, why do you still serve with this policy in place? Why would you do it? And they all looked at me and said, because it's, it's serving the country. It's the most honorable thing that I can think of doing right now in my life. There was another two images that had female couples' relationships. One of them is uh, that image where the soldier is standing with um, her uh, hands behind her back. In uh, the background of the image, you see a portrait of her partner. The service member was in Iraq. Um, her partner came down with um, a biopsy for her, her breast. And the entire time, she couldn't reach out to her partner because they were so afraid of outing each other um, for, to the military. That photograph of the soldier jumping on the bed, I instantly saw this connection between hanging, suicide, and the image. And during the time of the image, I was thinking a lot of the suicides that were going on in the military. There's a photograph um, where you see three sets of shoes, and you can see that they're children's shoes because of how small the shoes are. And then the um, legs um, in uniform of the, their father walking up the stairs. And that photograph was really important for me to capture the sense of family. You know, if this person got outed, they would lose their pension, their retirement benefits, their 20 years of service in the military would be gone. This is so powerful. That is so powerful. That one. I think the ability to show somebody's closetedness, this idea that they're hiding in many ways, they're, they can't reveal who they are, has a really profound effect on the way people see these images and think about the issue of Don't Ask, Don't Tell.